Right everyone, we're collector here. Right, I thought I'd do a video review on these uh, little Ganzo combo you can get now. This is the <coughs> the G723 and the G104. This is the G104, this is the G723. And this is basically a, a combo knife and multi-tool you can get from Gearbest. Uh, one thing I would mention, it's a, it's a colour mix uh, combo they call it. As far as I'm aware, this one will always be the same. But this knife, you don't have a choice and you will randomly get either orange, green or black. Now, personally, I don't mind that. It doesn't bother me if whatever one I got. I got the orange one. On the picture it shows green. But like I said, you can get randomly one of the three so i'll show you the knife first and we'll have a look at the uh the multi-tool afterwards so this is the knife this is the little pouch you get with the um ganzos if you've not seen them just a simple little drawstring pouch so it's a frame lock Quite a big knife. It is 22 centimeters open. It's 12 centimeters closed. It's got a 10.2 centimeter blade, which is about four mil thick. It's quite a nice thick blade, and it's uh, 27 mil wide. There's the blade there. The Firebird logo. No blade play in the blade at all. You've got dual thumb studs, open it either hand, but it obviously it's only um, well you can do these with your left hand, but they're slightly more um, slightly awkward doing it left-handed. But they are liner locks are or frame locks are able to be opened both ways. It's got a one-position clip that's removable steel clip. This steel side is stone washed. This side is G10 scales, getting three different colours. Torque screws. Blade is nicely lined up, as you can see there. Nice square in. No blade play, like I said. Got a lanyard hole. But yeah, overall, very nice knife. It's um, certainly comfortable. Like I said, it's a nice big knife as well, you know, or, um, I don't know how you describe it, it's not, a, it's not an overly, overly big knife, but it's not a little knife either, you know, it's like a, just what you'd call like a decent folder size. Yeah, very nice, I think. What else is there to stay at say, really? It's got some jimping on the back and a bit of a thumb ramp going on there. Yeah, comfortable, sharp as well. Ganto's come decently sharp straight out of the um, box as well, I always find. Yeah, so that is the G723 frame lock knife. So, um, <laughs> yeah. So now I'll show you the pliers. So this is the pliers, this is the little case you get with it, a little nylon case, it's quite nice. Spring loaded, and then when you fold them up they'll actually stay shut, so they will stay shut like that, fit in the case either way I think. Yeah that's a nice little case really, perfectly rebuilt. So. They're a small size pliers. They are seven centimeters closed, 35 mil wide, 13 millimeters thick, and <coughs> 10 centimeters open. So there they are. It says nine tools, but I counted at least 12 uses. So you've obviously got the pliers and wire cutter. And then the blades, which open when sh when it's shut. 
you know, you can have it open, I think, when you do it, but you wouldn't be able to get them out that way. So the tools are bottle opener and a flathead screwdriver, little flathead screwdriver, sort of little reaming blade there, and then a serrated blade. The blades on this are around about one and a quarter inches for the longest ones. So that's that side. Then the other side, you get a one inch blade, I think, yeah. Now the actual blade on this is about one and a quarter, the actual cutting edge. None of these lock either, so it'd be legal to carry. Another uh, flathead screwdriver, crosshead screwdriver, and then a nail file there. Like I said, none of them lock. They've all either got like a little, the little nail nick, or there's a bit there to put your nail in to get them out. And they're um, they've got a sort of spring back, if you know what I mean, that holds them. See there that sort of holds them open so they don't just fold on you easily so steel body with a plastic sort of liner that just I think that just covers up the, the edges really and makes it more grippy but yeah <coughs> really nice little set of multi-tool pliers I think and what makes this whole thing really good is the price these pliers and this knife together is £13.64p, which I think is amazing. Because this knife on its own is a tenner, I think, if you bought it from Gearburst. This, this is a deal from Gearburst, but this knife on its own, I think, is £10 plus. And as far as I'm aware, these pliers probably are as well. So you're getting quite a lot off. <coughs> also, if I can... Look in the more info section where the link for this is, and, and I'll see if I can put a discount code. I think I've got like a 10% discount code, possibly more. So you'll probably be able to get it even cheaper than 13.64. Now I think that's brilliant, really. You know, in dollars I think it's 17 dollars 66 for the pair. The only thing is the random colour, but that doesn't bother me in the slightest. Yeah, for that kind of price, I think that's really good. Nice little decent set of multi-tool pliers to put in a bug out bag or leave in your car. You know, or use every day, you know. And then a knife, nice decent knife with a good lock. Look at the lock up on that, it locks up decently. You know, very nice really, I think. So, yeah. If you're interested in these, the links will be below in the more info section. I'll try and get a discount if I can. And also, if you ever wanted to support this channel, you can buy buying some of the things I show from Gearbest using my links. You don't need to buy the actual specific items though. As long as you go to Gearbest, buy my links, and then buy something, anything... I'll get a percentage of what you spend, so that way you can support the channel by just buying stuff you want, you know, if you ever wanted to. So yeah, that's the Ganzo knife and pliers colour mix combo from Gearbest. Alright, hope you enjoyed the video. See you later.